Hello, good evening. Hi. Hi, Diego. Hi, Wilbert. Hi, teacher. Good. How are you? Good, and you? How was your day? Uh, good enough. Enough? <laughs> Wilbert, how was your day? Yeah. Hello? Um, I have a, a hard, hard day, mm. but uh, now I am fine. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm sorry to hear that. Diego, where do you work? Remind me. Uh, I'm working as a um, networking engineer. Okay. Yeah. So you're super good with computers. Um, not with, with computers, but not with, with networks, computers, but yes. with networks. Okay, okay, very good. And yeah. Wilbur, you're a little bit with, numbers, with right? computers. But... Okay. Sorry. Sorry, did you? No, I was telling Wilbur, and you, Wilbur, you're good with numbers, right? If I'm not mistaken, because you work with finances. Ah, oh, okay. You're very good with numbers, uh, right? Yes, my first first name is Wilbur, and the second name Benjamin. Ah, okay. No, but you in your job, you're good with numbers, with numeros. Are you good with numbers? Ah, uh, yes. With yes. statistics and numbers uh, and all that, right? Okay. For example, for for the statistics, for the analytic, from for, 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 for example, for series Fantastic. number series. Uh -huh. Serial yes. numbers uh, yeah, and forecasting. Yeah, in general, yes, yeah, in general for for the mathematics. Can, nah. So you're can, good with numbers. Okay. Con numeros. Es muy okay. bueno con numeros. Very good with numbers. Okay. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Ricardo, good evening. Hi. Hi. Good evening. How are you? Where do you work, Ricardo? Remind me again. I work in a call center. Okay, which call center do you work for? I work in Getcom. Ah, with Avianca, right? Yes, in front of the, the Yuka. Okay. Okay, great. How was your day? How was it? How was your shift today? It was good, but the air conditioning, it was too cold. Ah, you must imagine. I was, I was wearing a sweater, but I feel too cold in my department. Hi. What, what department are you in? Fulfillment, voluntary changes, sales? No, I am, I am Life miles? Baggage department. Ah, baggage, okay. Yes. Okay, great. Okay, Claudia, good evening. How was your day? Good evening, teacher. Uh, my, my day was very, very stressful and tired. I had, a, I'm planning um, celebration in my, in my entrepreneur in, in, in the work for Saturday. Okay. And where do you work? Remind me again. Sepa, Aeropuerto. Sepa. Ah, okay. So you're preparing a you're preparing a celebration for all the employees. Yes, is um, the uh, aeroport aeroport airport worker airport? day. Okay. Wow. So it's gonna be a magnum event. Big celebration. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And Good the, luck with that. Uh, they're gonna. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Yesenia, good evening. How are you? I'm fine. Your face, yeah, your face, like, I'm fine. <laughs> I can <laughs> see. Busy I'm day? <laughs> okay, was a busy day, a good day, or so so day? Um, so so day. Okay. Okay. 
Well, guys, today we're going to be doing going to versus will. What's the difference between going to and will? Simple. Will is 50-50. Okay, so simple. Today's tomorrow. Tomorrow is Thursday, man. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so imagine tomorrow, okay. that is Thursday. I tell you, guys, are you going to the beach tomorrow? And you're going to say, no, teacher, I'm going to work tomorrow. Um, I will go to the beach maybe Saturday. So if you doubt about your decisions or what's going to happen towards the future and you're not sure, 99% of the time, it's going to be will. Going to is when you're very sure of what your decisions are going to be, okay? So will is 50-50. Will you have proposals tomorrow? I will. I will have I, uh, I maybe. So if you're <laughs> doubting or yes, I am going to have proposals tomorrow. So then you're being sure about that. And you're gonna say going to. So going to is very sure about it. And will is a possibility. Maybe. You don't know right. if it's gonna happen. Right? There might something might show up on the way, okay? Now okay. we're gonna be I'm gonna share I'm gonna share my screen because it's a presentation on PDF, hopefully. There you go. So it's called what is going to happen. Are you guys able to see my screen? Do you see the bomb? Do you yeah. see the bomb on my yes, screen? Yes, I see. Yes. I can see. Okay. Yes, I can see it. Yes. Okay. Okay. So here the exercise was intended for a going to. I wasn't able to change it to a wheel, but the idea is don't pay attention to the instructions here. This is the idea. You're gonna look at a picture. And you're gonna tell me both what will happen, which is a possibility, and what is going to happen for sure. For example, I made this one, the first one. What for me it's going to happen is that they're going to dive into icy water. They will get sick, maybe. We don't know their health condition. We don't know if their condition is if they're very healthy. If they're very healthy, maybe they're not gonna get sick. But if their defenses are not that good, they might get sick, okay? So I'm using will. So I, I want you to use one statement with will that will happen, possibility, and one that it's going to happen on every picture that I'm going to project, okay? Yeah? Yes. Sure. Teacher, Sorry okay. to interrupt you. What yes. is the meaning of shiver? Shiver. Yes. When you get out of the bathroom and you start doing that, that's to shiver. Oh, okay. When it's really, really cold, you shiver. It's when you start trembling. Mm -hmm. That's yeah, the got it. Thank you. What do you say? Shiver. I don't understand. Okay, let's go with the first one. What will happen and what is going to happen, guys? Going to happen? <laughs> no. Will to happen. You have to tell me the complete sentence of what is going to happen based on the picture and what will happen. The K is going to fall down to the floor or on the floor. It's going to fall down on the floor. Down to the floor. Mm -hmm. And what will happen? Yes. Uh they going to have an embarrassing moment for the wearing in the wearing they are going to have an embarrassing okay that's going to okay give me examples with will possibilities of things that can happen but not for sure mm -hmm. they will feel they will sad. be angry okay maybe because we don't know right if they're going to be angry because they can be and that's another thing. Somebody mentioned, I don't, I, I, I didn't, I didn't check out the name, but somebody mentioned that they were going to feel embarrassed, but we don't know. It's not for sure. We're not there. We don't know if they're going to get embarrassed or not. They might, they might not. So if you're not sure what's going to happen, then we say will. Maybe, they will, maybe. yeah, because... Maybe they, they will 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 laugh. They maybe they will laugh. Uh -huh. It's a possibility. Maybe they will cry. Maybe they will 
gets disappointed. There's many things for Will. And going to what is going to happen, the cake is going to fall down. Okay, what about the, the people uh, attending the wedding? Are they going to eat cake or they will eat cake or they're not going to eat cake? What do you think? What do you think is going to happen? They won't yeah. eat cake. They aren't going to eat cake. They are not going to eat cake. Maybe, maybe they, they will. They, okay, or maybe they will eat cupcakes. Because it's a cake uh, yes. with many cupcakes. The cupcakes, yes. Uh -huh. Maybe, okay. We don't know, right? Okay. Maybe. Maybe. Very good. Next one. <gasps> oh. <laughs> what is going to happen and what will happen? Going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> because one person now that no that can what okay tell me samples with sentences of what is going to happen and what will happen how do you say polkar Dom, dom. No. Say that again, I'm sorry. Dump. How do you say volcar? Dump. It's going to dump. 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 Yes, mm -hmm. dump. Mm -hmm. um, Maybe they will they will call for a, a crane. Okay. Maybe they will call a crane, mm -hmm. uh, which is a grua. Um, uh, Okay. Yes. Maybe, but they when we use maybe, but listen, you products. have to be sure, you have to be, I'm sorry that I interrupt, you have to be sure of what you say, because if you say maybe, you're doubting, so maybe is will. If you're very sure of what's going to happen, 99.9%, and you have to say going to. So will, possibility, going to, for sure. For example, let me give you my example for this one. The truck is going to stay there for hours until they remove it or they pull it down or or they take it to us to the garage, okay, to the shop for it for it to be repaired. So it's going to happen. It's going to be there for hours because they are on a lonely street. So it's going to take the crane to get there, it's going to take, I mean, if you guys have a car and you have ever called a crane, you know it's not going to come in five minutes. So you're going to be there for hours waiting for the crane to arrive and pick you up. So what will happen, what you guys were saying, okay? So possibility, but what is going to happen, you have to be sure about what you say. And with will, you have to use maybe or perhaps, okay? Let's go to another example. That way you can. What's going to happen and what will happen? I'm not sure what is happening in this picture. It's an airplane. The, the person is looking out the, the window from an airplane and another the, airplane is coming to. Oh, the okay, got it. The, the airplane will crash with the other one okay very good we'll crash we don't know the passenger are going to take some pictures <laughs> okay the pack the passengers are going to take pictures okay the passengers are going to get scared or the passengers will get scared what do you think we'll be scared it's going, going to be a scare what, how would you feel in this position? Going to or will? Going to. Okay, okay. Very good. The passengers are going to get scared, okay? Get scared, okay. Get scared. Mm -hmm. Another one. Oh. Remember, this has electricity. Oh. Yes. Maybe. Maybe he will die. <laughs> Maybe he will die. <laughs> Tragic of you saying that. Okay, yeah, maybe he will die. Dangerous. Dangerous? Very good. Okay, yeah. maybe he will die. 
tangent rho. Or maybe he won't survive. Maybe he won't survive, okay. He will have a, an accident. He will have an accident, okay. Mm -hmm. Um, he's going to land somewhere, but he's going to land. Yeah. <laughs> he's, he's going to what? Land. 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 Oh, okay. Yeah, he's okay, going land. to land. So that's for he's sure. Going to land. We don't know where, but he's going to land. Okay, let's take a look at another one. <laughs> He's, she's going to be happy for eat this uh, candy. She's going to be happy eating this candy. Okay. She's going to paint his she, her face. <laughs> she's going to paint her candy. face. Yeah. Okay. Do you know the word sugar rush? Have you ever heard that word before? No, no. Sugar rush. Sugar the name rush. Of the... Let me write it here on the chat. Sugar rush. Sugar rush is when kids have when kids eat a lot of candy or sweet. They are all hyper. So, or when you have a lot of sweets and you're all hyperactive. So that is called, you have a sugar rush. You got sugar it's rush like a, having a lot of candy. It's candles. like a synonym of imperat imperativo. Uh -huh. Hi or imperativo. Like being hy hyperactive, hyperactive. Mm -hmm. The difference is that being hyperactive is just a state. Like somebody can be hyperactive without uh, eating candy. But when you eat candy, imagine you're a you're a laid back person, okay? Super serious. But all of a sudden you eat a lot of candy and then you get the sugar rush and you're like, you know, all accelerated and it's just momentaneum. But hyperactive is just as a tendency, somebody has it forever and ever and ever. But a sugar rush, you can get it in a moment and then it will go away. So what do you think? She's going to get a sugar, she's going to get a sugar rush or she will get a sugar rush? Yes, she's Did going a lot to. Of candy? Yes, going to. It's a lot of going to? Okay. Yes, going she's to. going to. She's going to? Okay. Let's check out the next one. Hmm. The boy will fall down. The boy will fall down. Okay. Mm -hmm. The grandmother is going to scream. The grandmother is going to scream. Very good. Okay. He going to have a a really pain in her back. Uh huh. She's going to, or he's going to. He's going to. Okay, he's going to have a big pain in his back. Mm -hmm. What else? Um, the grandma uh, will catch him. The grandma will catch him? Okay, it's a possibility. We don't know. Maybe yes, maybe no. Right? Okay, good job. Let's go to the next one. <laughs> I know. Uh, what is the animal in the picture? It's an it's a bear. It's um. 
It's a like a chow chow. Oh, okay. Oh. It's a dog. It's a dog. It's a dog. Yeah, it's like a chow chow. Uh -huh. Kind of look. Um, it's hashi. Hashi. Maybe. But I, I don't yeah. understand the picture. Maybe he he she's scared for the about the about the dog okay. or something like that. So if she's scared, maybe she will fall down to the stairs. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Teacher, what is the name of of the of these the stairs or? Very good. I was or... about to I was about to mention that. Okay, let me let me text you guys. Steps are graditas. For example, no more than ten are steps. Rope. Lasso. You say Stage. rope. Uh, steps are graditas. Okay. Ricardo, you were asking how do you say lasso? It's rope. Steps yes, how do you say lasso or cuerda? Rope. 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 Mm -hmm. I wrote it on the chat. Steps are graditas, no more than 10. Uh, stairs, I'm sorry, oh, steps. Like, for example, in front of your house, you might have two or three, per se. Two or three are called steps. Stairs are when you go from one level, on a building, when you go from uh, first, from the first floor to the second floor, you take the stairs, okay? A couple of stairs, not many. And ladder, ladder, ladder. is the one that he's on. Okay, ladder. ladder. So you have steps, graditas, stairs, gradas, and ladder, escalera. Okay, thank you. Welcome. Thank you. Okay, next one. Let's take a look at this one. What will happen and what is going to happen? Think outside the box, okay? If she was your little sister, if she was your niece, if she was your daughter. Uh, she will wet all her face with the soda. She will, she will wet all her face, okay, with the soda. Uh -huh. Or maybe even she all will, her clothes. Mm -hmm. She will spill the soda. She will spill the soda, okay. She will get in trouble or she's going to get in trouble. The parents are going to. <laughs> she will. She will be in pro in trouble. She will. She will, or she's going to. She will. Very good. She will get in trouble. Okay. Her parents are going to. Alguien dijo por ahí. Her parents are going to. Punish. Her. Punish her. Very good. Her parents are going to punish her. Okay. She might get a sugar rush Punish her or punish? That's the end. Okay, next one. Oh, I wish it was me. She won the lottery. She is going to celebrate and spend it. Her money. <laughs> she's going to she's going to celebrate and spend okay and spend all the money okay or spend a lot of money because now she's a millionaire. Okay, what will happen? Maybe. Tell me the maybes. He will pay her bills. Okay, she will pay her bills. She will donate. Maybe she will donate money to charity do you think no 
Do you think that people, whenever they win the lottery, they 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 donate money to others, like their family members or or other people, or no? Or they just uh, think about themselves? No, I guess they do. Maybe, maybe, mm -hmm. maybe. Okay. Maybe. Maybe. Think about yourself. Imagine it's you. Tell me now. Give me an example of. I am going to pretending you won the lottery and I will. Examples of pretending that you won the lottery, okay? What will you do and what would you do? Or what are you going to do with it? Uh, I don't know, teacher. Maybe. Uh, I, I will. The money. <laughs> I will travel for all the world. Okay. Think about I that. I would Ines. travel in a cruise. On a cruise? Yes, on a, in a cruise. On a cruise, okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Let's go with the next one. Oh my God. Don't try this at home, please. He's going to, to have an accident. He's going to have an accident for sure. Okay. He's going to break her bones. Break? He's going to his break bones. His, he's going to break his bones. Okay. Mm -hmm. What else could happen? He's going to finish painting before falling down. Or do you think he's not gonna finish painting? He isn't. He isn't finished painting because he has. The, he will move the. He need to move the. How do you the, call them? Buckets. 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 Bucket. Uh, bucket. Buckets. Buckets. Okay. Also, like we saw the other day. Oh, okay. Bucket like a bucket. Okay. Maybe he will finish the job without Maybe any action. Okay, could could be. Let's be positive. Let's not kill him before time, right? Maybe yeah. he will survive and he will not break any bones and he will finish his job with no incidents. Okay. Next one. <laughs> I know. <laughs> What is going to happen and what will happen? <laughs> He's going to be afraid for clown. Of clown. clown? He's going to be afraid of clown. Very good. And I think this is very real. I, I, I really like this picture because it's real. I have had a lot of students yeah. in the past that tell me that they, that they, their biggest fear when they were small or they were kids, they were afraid of clowns. So doing this to a kid is like incentivating or incentive this kid to, to have that fear towards clowns. Right? Usually, usually it happens. Kids, kids tend to be afraid of clowns. So when they grow up, they say, "I don't like clowns because of this." Right? So they tend to be scared. So it's possible he's going to be scared of clowns. Okay, very good. Let's go with the next one. He is going to scream and cry out. He's going to scream and cry it out. Okay. What else? A 
Okay, so for the remaining slides, I have 15 mm -hmm. out of 23. 15. Um, yeah, okay. So for the rest eight slides, I'm going to send them to you. And I'm going to make groups and I want you to discuss them with your groups, okay? To see the possibilities of what's going to happen and what will happen, okay? Wow. So I'm going to send the groups okay. first and then I'm going to send you the slides. I'm just going to make like two groups because we just have four. Very good. I'm going to send you the presentation that way. Okay, guys, I sent you the presentation on WhatsApp, so you can open it on, it's a PDF, and discuss the slides, okay? I want to listen to you. Okay. I we were doing number 15, have, I think. I didn't have teacher. Presentation? I sent it uh, on WhatsApp. Oh, yeah, I think. I, I have it. I have it. Oh, okay. going to happen it. Hi guys, I just sent you the presentation, Hi. okay? For you to practice okay. on WhatsApp. So you okay. can open it wow. and then go, to, uh, send it on WhatsApp so you can open it and practice, okay? Okay. Let's see. Hi, Diego. Uh, hi, Ricardo. Hi, Juan. Hi. Hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, guys. Um, okay. Uh, do you have the presentation? Yes, I have it. I open it in this moment. Okay. I think we're like on slide 15, if I'm not mistaken, like on page 15. That was the last one we did, okay? Okay. Yes. Um, and we we have to work at the 15 mm -hmm. slide and yes the other ones yeah. yes from number 15 and then you would say what's going to happen i think they're 23 so we just have like eight more to go so just mm -hmm. um talk about what will happen or what it's going to happen next okay giving your opinion 
-hmm. I can I can open the the PDF. You can't open the PDF. Mm, let me see. Let me try to send you the image for number 50 on WhatsApp, okay? One by one. Okay. So you can look at them. He he going to he going to room. He going to room. Uh huh. He's going to run. Uh huh. He going to uh, room. Okay. Um. He will. Uh, he will have an injury. He how injury. An injury, um, una herida. He will fall down. Okay. The next one. Uh, She's going to cut her hair. Uh, yes. She will will be. He will cry. He will, she will cry. She will cry. She will be. She will be sad. Mm -hmm. Sure, the man is running or looking. For a safe place. Uh, crash the ice. Yes. They, they they are going to, to crash the ice. Yeah. They will be sick because of the. Cold. Now look at the picture. Uh, In the picture, it says thin ice. Yeah, they will be crushed. Yes. The ice. Like remember the movie Jack Frost? What happened to Jack Frost before he became Jack Frost? Have you seen that movie? They, no, but I think he the dance, they will, dance. They will be frost. Frost. What happens when there's thin ice? It breaks. So you can easily, yeah. if it's a lake, you can easily drown in ice. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh. Okay. Let me mm -hmm. share the other ones. The other you don't have the other pictures, right? No. Let me check. Let me see if I can share them. Can you see them? 
uh, yes. Okay. Uh, this chart. The first is the, the man who is running, then is a girl and that he's cutting her hair and a couple they are dancing the the ice. Just remember that it's thin ice. So what can happen in thin ice? No, thin ice is going to broken. Break. It's going to broke. It's going to break. break sorry. Mm -hmm. Going to break. And what happened? What they happen? will, they will fall into the cold water. Okay. Uh huh. And they can, and they, they, like the story of Jack will, Frost. Yes, and how do you say um, hypothermia? 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 Mm -hmm. Hypothermia? Hypothermia. Mm -hmm. And they can drown too. They can drown. Ahogarse. They can drown in ice also, in icy water. Mm -hmm. Probably nobody will help them. Okay. And for the next picture. Mm. I'm sorry, Ricardo. Maybe, maybe going to interesting, interesting. What do you say, patina? How do you patina. say? What do you say, patina? Skate. Ice, ice, ice skate. Ice, ice skate. Ice skate. Ice skate. Ice skate. Mm -hmm. Maybe they're going to skate. Interesting ice skate and dangerous. Yeah, it's dangerous because it's thin ice. Mm -hmm. Sweet. Okay. Yeah. Which picture are you discussing now? What, where are you right now? Uh, if the the bicycles the Bi bicycle the the he he's going to uh, he's going to fell fell the other ones the she's going to botar a los a los otros este. He's gonna make the rest fall down. Oh, okay. He's going to down, make the rest down. fall down. He's going to fall make down. rest fall down. He's going to the rest fall down. Uh -huh. Make. He's going to make. Uh, el va a causar. He's going, He's to, going to make the rest. Uh huh. Fall down. Okay. El va a causar que los demás se caigan. Uh huh. Yes. Rest fall down. Okay. I'm going to make accident. He, he, no I, sino que él, porque es, he is going to, he going to provoke, make, provoke, 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 accident. He's going to provoke an accident, very good. Mm -hmm. He's, uh, he's going to, to have an injury. Okay, he's going to have an injury. Mm -hmm. he, he's going to broke. The break, break the um, oh, 
la, la pierna. Eh. His legs. Leg. Uh -huh. He's going to break his leg. The leg. Uh -huh. Oh, he will, go, he will break his leg. Mm -hmm. Very good. And then we have another one with a tattoo and some boxes. What happens in the next picture? Oh, I don't have it. Yeah, I send it on the top. Okay. That way you have, you can check it out. Tattoo. <laughs> but look at tattoo. the picture. You should tattoo. But the drawing is not the same, like, it's not the same as the one he is showing her or him. He's. He's going to He's be upset. Going to He's mm, going to be help, upset or help. angry. <laughs> it looks like a help. dolor de cabeza. Help. He's going to have a headache. Again, he's headache. going to have a headache. Uh huh. Imagine headache. if that was to happen to like someone in real life. I mean, I don't know if it this actually happened, but imagine. Uh, he's going to cry. <laughs> he's going to cry. How can you remove a tattoo from your body? No way around, right? Unless you draw another tattoo on top of it. Wow. Yeah. Okay. And the last one. With the boxes. Hello. Oh, There's a... Bicycle. A bicycle? Uh huh. Carrying a lot of boxes. A bicycle. I'm going to go. He is going to? Uh, he's going to. To. Big. Okay. Big. Uh, yeah. wave. Big. Hola. See, big wave. Bay head. Big. Oh. Mm -hmm. What about the next picture? The cyclist is going to break bicycle? his wrist. The, the, the bicycle. Is, oh, the, bici the bicycle the is the item, but the cyclist, the ciclista, the cyclist is going to break his wrist mm -hmm. in the ground mm -hmm. and he's going to make a big um he's going to provoke provoke uh, how do you say rasparse ah okay uh -huh. uh, to have a uh spur spur hold on spur what is it i'll tell you in a bit I always confuse that with the spurn. Spurn. It's torn. Um, what? Um. Scrape. 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 Is going to spread her legs. And he will lose the race. Yeah, maybe. Mm hmm. He's going to ring or damage his bike. Mm hmm. Okay. Maybe he's going to provoke. An accident. He's going to. He's going to be the one causing an accident with the other bicycles, because with the speed yes. they're not going to be able to stop, right? Yes. To the speed. Mm -hmm. Okay. What about the next picture? Let's go with the next one.
the man is going to claim for a reimbursement. <laughs> claim for a reimbursement. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. That was a good one. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. What would you do? Imagine yeah. if that was to happen to you. Like you, you think that person's actually going to tattoo you the picture that you're taking, and then all of a sudden, I will look for another uh, studio or try to um, make a new tattoo. On to, top of the one that you. Um, how do you say uh, that? In, in order to hide the this tattoo that is very <laughs> basic. <ugly. laughs> basic. Okay, yeah, it's super ugly. Okay, okay, very good. And the last one with the boxes. What's up with those boxes in the bicycle? Mm -hmm. What do you think is going to happen? He is going to fall down the boxes and mm -hmm. destroy the items that are inside. Okay. And he is going to provoke an uh, accident. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, very good. Thank you. I'm gonna take you guys back to the main screen, so I let you guys okay. go. Okay. Guys, thank you very much for joining today. Time is running up. Um, we only, where'd the rest go? Where did the rest go? They disconnected. Maybe they had to do others. I don't know. Um, but thank you so much. Remember that you have until the 25th to complete the platform. Um, I'll be seeing you tomorrow, same time, same place. Okay. And um, okay. thank you so much for participating. I really, I, I really like it when you participate because I feel that whenever you practice on the platform, you get the opportunity to practice to yourself. But whenever you're here with me or with a teacher, then you get to practice the way, if you're saying it correctly, if you're structuring or learn new vocabulary words and so on, right? So take advantage of this great opportunity. I think it's, it's awesome. And I'll be seeing you guys tomorrow, okay? Bye, teacher. See you tomorrow. Bye, teacher. Tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Have a fantastic Bye, day guys. tomorrow, okay? Okay, goodbye. Good Blessings. Bye. Blessings to you too. Bye. Bye. Bye.